Hi, I'm Hanako, a junior from Team 5700 Soda Cyber Dragons, and this is our week five update video. It's week five, and all the divisions of our team are making the final sprint before the end of the build season. On the technical front, most of our designs are complete. So we're finishing up mounting brackets and small things, but most of the major components are ready to be fabricated. In the shop, we're dealing with tons and tons of parts that we're making, and so we're spending a lot of time teaching freshmen how to use the tools properly and get really nice tolerances and accuracy with our drills and, and saws and all of that. One of the challenges with the design was making a part work with the loose tolerances that we have in our shop. We don't have access to advanced computer controlled milling, routers, and all of that. So most of the designers have spent a lot of time making sure that whatever designs or the parts we make will still work if they're you know, a sixteenth off or an eighth of an inch off. On the programming side of things, it's difficult to program a robot that doesn't exist yet. I've been working with our old robot, developing our PID capabilities and making it possible for our robot to control a position of various subsystems autonomously without a driver controlling it. Hello, my name is Alexander Hocken, and I'm a freshman in the mechanical engineering department of our robotics team. I've been working on manufacturing components for the dragon wing of our robot, which will help other alliance partners climb. Be sure to look for that in the reveal video of our robot. I'm Alex Linhart, I'm a software in the mech end department, and I'm working on a piece right now for our arm system. When we climb up, we're going to be assisting two other robots, and this is our mounted piece for the arms. We'd like to thank our parents, mentors, and sponsors for assisting us throughout the build season. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next week.